Steam rolling here towards the middle of January, and of course, we're looking at football and the divisional playoffs. But I tell you what, we have a potpourri, a Hungarian goulash, if you will. And if you don't believe me, wait to hear some of these names and me trying to pronounce them in our top 10 plays of the week. We begin with thrills and chills in college Purdue. basketball. Purdue's got to go the length of the court in under a second. And they do it. Carl Landry to tie the game against Indiana to the chagrin of Mike Davis. But Indiana wins a double overtime. Now, buzzer beaters. Anthony Anderson to Rashawn Freeman. Good! UMass over George Washington in overtime. Now, at to the Pac-10. Tied at 73, Salim Stoudemire! Arizona over UCLA. Then, TCU, the Horn Frogs, Corey Santee behind the back end. Ah, good! TCU beats Memphis, but wait, as they say in late night TV, there's more. Fordham's Kevin Anderson, bang! As Fordham beats Xavier at the buzzer. And the Drexel Dragons, Bashir Mason, what a heave! And Drexel over VCU. Wow, those dogs can play. And what about these dogs? In the Ekanuba Dog Show, Rufus, he's your 14-time best in show, that colored bull terrier. And then this is Quincy, a four-year-old Commodore. Uh, this Commodore, it's a dog. Howls. Meanwhile, Nuggets mascot Rocky. How does he do it? Hey, Bull Wickle, how do we do it? Now bowling. Micah Koya Viemi. I'll never attend those. He gets the 10 pin behind his back. 45 pin. This is hilarious. <laughs> Brad Angelo with a routine 45 pin strike. Hockey, please. BC's Ryan Shannon against our tribal BU. Short in. He deeks, he fakes, he shoots, he scores! BC over BU. Yes, they're the Terriers. And then European hockey. Yes, here's Jaromir Jager. His avant-garde umtsk team beats the Finnish team. Figure skating Kimi Meister. 15 years young, the triple axle first by U.S. skater since Tanya Harding in 91. But at Portland, Oregon, the grace the championship style of Michelle Kwan. She's done and won this thing before, as in nine times. Congratulations, U.S. National Championship. Ah, oh, it's one of my islands. Wai'alai in Oahu, Honolulu. The Hawaiian Open, Woody Austin, the Hartford champ. Eagling. Shigeki Mariyama out of the sand. Eagling, but if you're gonna get an eagle, Shigeki says, I can top this. You just hope in your lifetime you can do this once. On the fourth hole, Mariyama. You're kidding. Look at this shot by Mariyama. Doink! It's in! And Mariyama contended most of the way, but alas, didn't win it, but provided us from some thrills. Now, and now our top five. We're ready for some football. Play five, the East-West Shrine game at SBC Park in San Francisco. Florida State's Chauncey Stovall in a game between the East and West. Runs East, then runs West. Uh-oh, he's going to... No, then he'll run East. And then he's going to run... Oh, boy, he's going North to the house, into the left field seats. Touchdown. Divisional playoff action. This is the Philadelphia Freedom. What? Into the hands of Freddie Mitchell after L.J. Smith has its court loose. Philadelphia Freedom. From the day that I was born, I waved the flag and scored the touchdown. And on defense, the Eagles, after a month in the cone of silence, Ike Reese's pieces, Eagles beat the Vikes. You think Atlanta can run the ball? Third play of the game, Michael Vick against the Rams. See these eight and eight teams, get out. Vick. 47 yards, cruising. Not to be confused with his teammate Warwick, well done. Swimming upfield, and then kind of lopes the last 20. No one can get him. He had 62. The Falcons ran for 327 yards, fourth best all time. Then Allen was playing Rossum. Set a punt return record for the postseason. The Allen Rossum project. Doom, 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 doom. Touchdown, Falcons to the championship game in the NFC, in the AFC. What a great game in Pittsburgh. Santana Moss. 
a rolling stone could gather no moss could go all the way 75 yards the jets coming from behind and then Ben Roethlisberger was slipped the tongue by Reggie. He makes the pick, and he could go all the way and beat the robot. Mr. Roboto had a tough game, but in the end, overtime for Pittsburgh. Jeff can read. Good Steelers. OT moving on to host the championship game against. How would New England stop Peyton Manning and the Colts? Troy Brown looks like he's been playing defensive back for 10 years. Corey Dillon, he's been running like this for eight years, but never in the playoffs, never a Patriot. Way above 44. The Patriot linebackers and Rodney Harrison at safety. Roman Pfeiffer with the hit. Teddy Bruschi on the fumble. McGinnis, all of them. Teddy Johnson, they all were great. They held the team to three points and scored 571.